Howdy folks, welcome back, it's me Impulse, bringing you some World of Tanks gameplay in the background. I know the title says uh, an update on my PC, but first let me tell you about this gameplay. I haven't played this tank, it's a Tiger 1, for over a week and a half until this game. I was having bad times, so I just couldn't do anything. I, this gun has a 203mm of penetration, I was bouncing off light tanks which only had 25mm of armour. And it was pissing me off, and I decided to stop playing it for a week and a half. And this is my first game back on it, and... I hope you enjoy it because it turns out to be a really good game. And ever since that, I've been having good games on it. <laughs> but, as I said in the title of the video, it's an update on my PC. And especially, what I want to before I say that, I want to really say thank you to Tango, Echo Alpha and Blues and Twos. These are the greatest friends I've had on gaming and PC gaming and YouTube in for a long time. And to be honest, GK Gaming is another person I like to thank because he sends me uh, gaming and some video clips every now and then, which I put up my channel, which I really thank him for that as well. But Blue uh, Tango Echo Alpha and Blues and Twos, you know, the greatest friends possible. I've helped Blues and Twos out on his uh, PC build by sending him an SSD. He sent me a, uh, a R9 280X, which happened to be sent from to him by Tango Echo Alpha. So Tango Echo Alpha helped Blues. Blues helped me. So it, you know, we've been helping each other. However, as you know, my CPU has been playing up, and it keeps dropping down to four cores. It's getting more and more often now, so it won't be long till I, my CPU will turn into a four-core CPU. <laughs> However, Tango Echo Alpha said, I'll tell you what, I got some, I'm, I'm sending something through the post. And I thought, what are you on about? Because I was signed autograph, and I literally turned and said, well, okay, I'll put it with my other signed autograph of Blues and Twos. <laughs> Which he laughed. It turns out he sent me his old motherboard. Uh, you don't know this, he had an issue with his power supply and it went kaput. So he, when he was waiting to get a new power supply, he decided he was going to update from uh, his old system up to Skylake. So he did that. So you got DDR4, he's got a Skylake uh, i7 Skylake processor on, and a motherboard to go with it. And he was going to use his other motherboard and his other CPU to create another uh, PC for downstairs for entertainment purposes, you know. And he was working on it, and however, when he watched my video and saw that I was having issues with my CPU, he decided he's going to send this motherboard and CPU to me. And it arrived. A couple of, uh, it arrived yesterday. And it turns out to be, ready for this? A Z97A motherboard from Asus. Which means it's an Intel processor motherboard, which means he sent me an i7 49k. This is one of the CPUs I was looking into at one time. I come, it, I wasn't expecting him to do this. I, I knew he said he was, he sent me something, he sent me something, but I didn't expect that. <laughs> I honestly didn't expect that, and that absolutely shocked me. It made me realize how really good friends I have with Blues and Twos, Tango Echo Alpha, also, my friend GK Gaming is uh, a really good friend because he's been sending me videos every now and then to put on my channel of new games coming out. And also, you know, you know, it's really fun. It, someone would like to help each other. It's great. Uh, it's fantastic. And for uh, Tango Echo Alpha to send me that and not accept any money for it is absolutely fantastic. Uh, I I'm rich, literally humbled about it. So. He did tell me I do need to find a CPU cooler, and I've been looking at CPU coolers, and I got, and I limited it down to three at the time. <laughs> I limited it down to the Cooler Master 212X. I limited it down to the Noctura uh, D15, and I also brought. Uh, was looking at a Be Quiet uh, 120, uh, the original, you know, the first cooler I have. However, I've gone for something different. It's a Be Quiet one, but I've gone for the Be Quiet Shadow Slim. Excellent reviews. It's very similar to their first fan, but this one's a little bit different. It doesn't have a 120mm fan, it has a 135mm fan. It doesn't overlap the uh, RAM slots, so you can put it on perfectly sorted and it won't even touch the RAM slots. It's absolutely fantastic, and it's only around about uh, an extra, I think, uh, eight pound more. And I, I'm thinking, ooh, and the performance is a lot better. 
and then the other Be Quiet fans are looking at it, and I decided I'm going to order it, and I've ordered it, it's still arrived tomorrow, so I'm going to hopefully next Monday be in sorting up my PC, hopefully, and get it working. <laughs> um, I'm hoping I don't have to reinstall Windows. Uh, it is hardware related, so which means I probably have to reinstall it because it'll be set up on my AMD motherboard, so I definitely might have to uh, reinstall it, which is going to be a pain in the butt. <laughs> Damn. But it's all worth it if I get a working PC, an 8-core PC. Uh, fantastic. I'll be able to play games better. And that means then I will be looking towards getting my new graphics card. And I've already decided it all depends on reviews and benchmarking of this card. But I'm looking at the RX 480. A lot of people are already saying that this is going to be the 1080p stroke 1440p graphics card. And it's going to bring VR to the masses who can't afford all this ultra fantastic £700 or £500 or £600 graphics cards. This is going to bring it to people who, can, who can't afford all that high end. So this is going to be literally a fantastic option. I honestly am thinking of going for the RX 480. It all depends on the reviews, but this is what I, I, I really want to get to. And to be honest, they've already said, AMT has already said that uh, two 480s will beat a 1080. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, you take so two of them together... If you buy the 4 gig version, say £400 or $400, whatever it is going to be in the, I'm not sure it's going to be in the UK, it's going to be a one graphics card which is uh, priced at around about £500 or £600. Yeah, right. <laughs> this is going to be absolutely great. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that like button. Don't forget to check out Tango Echo Alpha's channel. You know, he's a great bloke. Uh, Blues and Twos and also GK Gaming. Don't forget to check out all their channels, but... If you want to, go over to Tango Echo Alpha's channel and tell him thanks from me. <laughs> but until next time, it's me, Impulse, signing off. Hope you enjoyed this. It was a massive gameplay. First game back on this tank for over a week and a half. Unbelievable. <laughs> and I'll catch you all very soon. Take care, folks. Bye for now.